the area administration and uh, the security team at large. We were here purposely for a project which has been awarded to us by CDF Board Nairobi. You know we have 290 constituencies and uh, for you to get, get a CSR from an organization like CDF, you must work extra hard and your work must be convincing for you to get it because it's a very rare opportunity to get. So here we, were, we are awarded a project of uh, three classrooms which are going to be built to complete on and be equipped with the desks and everything, water, roof catchment, and eight toilets. So that's what we have launched here today, and uh, the contractor is here with us. So we are looking forward for this project to be completed very fast, so that uh, when we are opening school, our children can now get enough space to study in. Uh, when I want to talk generally about education, we have received results of uh, primary uh, KCP, which I want to report that uh, for the first time we are cheating free and uh, as a sub-county I'm very happy because uh, we used to be blamed in all uh, quarters but this time I think it is praise everywhere. Our performance is not very bad. Uh, we have a good number of students who I believe will go to national schools. So what I want to ask the community now that we are preparing and we have enough time to take our kids to perform one in July we don't want to see a situation whereby a candidate who has performed very well in school, ready to go for secondary school, as well as our girls, will be reported to be pregnant. It will be very disappointing and it will open a very big Pandora because we love to face the parents because we are not ready to lose even a kid without joining from one. For those who are extremely poor and uh, might not be able to support their kids, I want to promise that uh, so long as I'm still the MP here, none of our students who are willing to go to secondary school will drop at primary level. We'll try our level best to support each and every kid to join a secondary school and uh, achieve what's meant for them. On the infrastructure, with the current uh, corona situation in the country, we still face a challenge as a constituency. Even though we have tried to improve uh, infrastructure of schools, but I can uh, report here today that uh, whatever we have achieved, is good but not enough. So ourselves and uh, our community and the government which has been also supporting us hand in hand, I do, I want to ask all of them not to relent. We continue with the same spirit and ensure that uh, we achieve the potentiality which our people are looking for. On uh, the issue of uh, infrastructure on the side of schools, I want uh, also appreciate what our teachers have done. Uh, when we started, it was not easy for teachers to be retained in this uh, sub-county because there were a number of challenges. But uh, those who have uh, been with us here today have uh, supported us to realize some very good improvement. I want to echo them and promise that uh, I'll still work with them until we achieve all that our people are intending to achieve so that our kids can be comfortable here. Our dream was that uh, at the beginning of term, we don't see our kids going to bordering schools. We want all our kids to study in Yatike. If you look at the statistics, you'll find we have reduced population of our students going outside by more than 